Hi everyone and welcome back. I am Lisa. If you've been watching me for a while, who remembers this? Bringing back my old mukbang, 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 um, um, <laughs> glass thing here with ginger ale. So today's lunch is Chinese food. It's Friday night. Well, Friday afternoon, so you're eating lunch with me. And um, I have a spring roll here. And it's shrimp and broccoli and shrimp and fried rice. I got the lunch special. If I knew that they were gonna give me white, well, normally they put the white rice separately, but now they put it in that container. If I knew, then I would just have ordered the fried rice with it and save money. We're getting um, a separate shrimp with fried rice. But anyway, um, let me adjust. Hold on a second here. Uh, I don't want to like edit or anything. This is just going to be raw. Um, <laughs> raw eating as far raw as far as me not editing. Okay, so let's say grace. All right, so I normally don't eat with soy sauce and a little bit of duck. Um, <laughs> for the egg roll thing and sometimes for whatever. I was about to say I don't have any napkins, but I actually have napkins over here. So yeah, guys, I wanted to do a lunch Friday um, kind of mukbang kind of thing here and um, eat lunch with you guys. Um, it's been a busy morning already. So um, I accomplished so much. And um, so what time is it? Like almost one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Eat your broccoli. So I've been trying to get the yard all cleaned up and do I have clips? I don't know what I'm filming for what I'm not filming to be quite honest. But but today's Friday. I already got, it's so hot outside. Oh my gosh, I gotta do everything early. I gotta do everything early because it's too, too hot out there. After all, it is hot Lanta. Atlanta. Um, my hair looks a mess. I'm a, I'm always looking a mess on on the videos. Oh my gosh. But anyway. I got so much accomplished. I'm so thankful and grateful for that because I planted some more t um, potatoes. Some should be ready to harvest in a week or two or a couple of weeks. Um, but I planted some new ones. First time growing potatoes, so we'll see how it comes out. Cleaning up the garden. Okay, so I'm doing a lot of um, I'm doing a lot of stuff spiritually as far as my Bible study you know, um, um, witnessing and all that kind of stuff. So my schedule is all over the place. Plus for my small business, I'm going to farmers markets and events. And, um, but this year I'm just off as far as, um, and I, I need to prioritize because I do have a lot, but sometimes when I look at other people's schedule or hear their schedule, they they have much more stuff going on. And I, all of this is, not even important, if that makes sense, meaning that um, I admire the people who are actually doing stuff sp spiritually and trying to serve God and doing the right thing, meaning that the dedication, you know, that they bring forth, you know, um, it's really admirable, you know? Mm -hmm. Here I am talking about my schedule. <laughs> 
<laughs> so yes, the schedule that I created, but it's uh, it's about having priorities. And um, lately, we've just been in a cleaning mood to clean everything. You know, when you get into that mood, like um, I always clean, but it's like deep cleaning. And even to the point that my son is like, oh, the backyard looks so good. I'm like, oh my gosh. Plus I have to finish power washing because I power wash the back patio, but it was so hot and in, um, in the night that I did it and it still needs like one more go over, but I didn't, I wasn't in the mood to do it, to finish it up properly, but at least it's clean, clean, but it needs to be a hundred percent clean. It's about 90%. <laughs> Yeah, what else is going on? <laughs> oh, there's so much going on. Um, so Lucky has a teeth loose, and he needs teeth cleaning actually. <laughs> it's like four hundred dollars and up. Having a dog is just like having a human, almost. It's your baby, you wanna take care of them. But I think the, sometimes, cause I called around for pricing. In the rich neighborhoods, it's a lot more. And, but I think the baseline is around 400. So it's 400, 600, 700, something like that. And if they need more work done, it will be close to a thousand. This is all dental. But yeah. But it has to be done some way, somehow, right, Lucky? Exactly. So I'm just monitoring it to see if he's in a lot of pain. Um, but it's so loose and basically it's plaque. I think the plaque was so heavy and I brush occasionally. I don't know. I just have a problem with dental for humans and dogs. I, I you know, I have a love hate relationship with the dentist and I was doing fine with one dentist and then she said she doesn't accept my insurance anymore. And then I had to go to the one that I don't like because that he was the only one that accept my insurance. So I was just like, I'm over it. But yeah. But now, um, if you've been watching me, you know I have a couple of teeth up here missing and it's supposed to have an implant there. But now I'm looking at it and I'm like, but it looks like the gum is thinning or I don't know. I've had so much, I don't know. I'm at the point like, I don't care. I don't know. I'm not going to go through all of that. But I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to find. I don't know. Either they moved then, then one of my other doctors moved to another area. Uh, so I think everybody's just doing their own thing. They don't care. Just doing their own. Everybody's just living their own life. Hello. <laughs> but anyway, what are you having for lunch? <laughs> if you're not having lunch, then maybe you having maybe you had a late breakfast or you're gonna have an early dinner. I don't want to talk so much when I'm chewing. I see a lot of people are like, oh, I'll talk with your mouth full. My son's been saying that. I don't talk with my mouth full, but he's like, chew your food and finish what you're saying. You know, you know it's almost fair. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> so anywho, so you're probably wondering about the back there. So my son does the front, I do the back because the back has like my garden and stuff like that. So I don't really want him to like mess with my garden too much because I have certain things, certain places and what have you. But yeah. Um, so Florida just had some kind of flood because you know, my family's down there. But everyone's okay. <laughs> Mm 
So I'm gonna do a shout out. Hi, Trevor. Hi, mommy. Hi, fam bam. Hi, go to Lisa fam bam. <laughs> they watch my videos. <laughs> At least I know somebody is. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I'm starting to see if it was a spring roll. Mm-hmm. So at the end of the month is usually busy time for us um i did have on the schedule that we're supposed to go back and start playing tennis because you know somebody was like okay but then i couldn't do it a couple of weeks we, supposed to, we were supposed to start a couple of weeks ago and then he didn't want to so i was like okay and then be before i didn't want to and then but the, today i feel like it but it's so hot up there but that's the thing I didn't want to because he wanted, talk about my son, wanted to play in the middle of the day. Who plays tennis when it's 90 to 100 degrees? I would be out there like, I already sweat a lot, okay? Because I have hypohydrosis, okay? But throughout the years, it has gotten, you know, they did say it will disappear after a while. I sweat, okay? I don't know about you all, but I sweat, but I think I need to sweat more if that's strange enough for me to lose the weight a little bit. But anyway, but the bottom line is that it's the humidity. You have to be careful when you're playing out there. And plus it's a vigorous sport. You're using your mind and physical physicality of it. And it's like, you want me to go out there in, in what kind of degree to go play tennis? The tennis court have to be like shaded, but still, it's just so hot. I'd rather do stuff. I'm an early person. I'm an early bird person. I'd rather do stuff early, early in the morning, and he's a late person. So trying to find that middle, I know. Isn't it sad? I don't have nobody to play with but my son. <laughs> I when, when we first moved down here a long time ago, um, we did look into tennis clubs and stuff like that. But everything is all in the rich, rich, rich neighborhoods. They did have one close to us um, where they had some kind of team or something. But what was wrong with that one? I think he was younger and, and with after school, all that kind of stuff. It's like fitting it in. And then all of these clubs were like after lunchtime. And I was like, I was working during that time. So I was like, you want me to take off work to, to so the timing and the schedule it didn't work together so it, it's catered i think more to people who are at home but that's why i didn't do it but i did look into it years ago and there were a few options but there weren't that many options on my side of town um there was one and even one of the chiropractors told me about it but the the schedule and the timing when they had it, it was just kind of weird. And you had to pay membership dues and stuff. It wasn't bad back then, but yeah. Nowadays, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I went to get an oil change today. I've been living in this area for 18 years, in this vicinity, first in my apartment for five years and now for my house um, for years. And there was this, always this place I would pass all the time that does oil change. And today I went there for the first time and I was like, how much you charging me? I was like, wow. So lesson learned. I'm going back to the dealership. The dealership is actually for the first time a little bit cheaper 
versus uh, in regards to oil changes so even my son was like why didn't i go because i was like i was rushing and i i didn't have time to make an appointment and i didn't have time to do this so if they did advertise a 10 minute oil change but it ended up being 15 minutes and made me late to another thing i had to go to so i was just like it is what it is but i was just like not again who knows who knows i don't know I'm just a single woman out here, a single mom doing it all. You know what I mean? And I have been doing it for years. And, um, but with inflation and everything, it's like, I gotta look at the prices. I gotta look at, sometimes cheap is not always better. It's not. And sometimes I wonder if they look at you and they just figure, oh, you're a woman and they're gonna charge you, I don't know. And, but I already talked about this on my live the other day, but anyway, guys. So what am I gonna do for the rest of the day? Okay. So I'm just gonna chillax, see what's <laughs> on TV. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> mm -hmm. Hopefully, eventually get a nap in somewhere, somehow. I was thinking about laundry, if I finish my laundry. I think I have one or two. I'm washing, like, pillows right now as far as decorative pillows. Um, I washed some of the rugs yesterday. Um, but, yeah, finish up that laundry. See what's on TV. There's nothing good coming on at all. Um... Uh, uh, hmm. I was going to say something, but then I don't want to put it on my schedule, but, um, um, but basically Monday nights on Instagram, if you follow me on Instagram, I post like what movie I'm watching on Monday night. Like every Monday night, I'm typically watching some weird movie or some unique movie or something that I haven't seen. Um, but I'm a mystery girl, so I think I may just chillax and watch an old Sherlock Holmes um, series or something. I love um, seeing that time period and um, just the mysteries. I think they were filmed in the 80s or something like that. <laughs> and... You're such a good doggy sitting there while I'm filming. Aw. And um, that's it for Friday night. Um, just tidy up a little bit around the house. I may go back out in the garden this evening. Um, I do need to go back out because I do need to I have the, the labels. So I do need to label the potatoes and when I actually planted them because I'm not going by this <laughs> memory because um, there's too many things planted out there right now. So I need to keep track because the potatoes you can harvest in 90 days or 120 days. So I need to keep track of that. And, um, but yeah, pretty much straighten out the garage a little bit, um, clean the car yesterday. So just been cleaning little by little. And, um, Eventually, I'll do a cleaning video and bring those back eventually. And I don't know why my boobies always look like it's slow. TMI. But anyway, um, but yeah, um, I was trying to think if I want to go back out there. I don't know if I'm going to be doing the power wash today. I have to be in the mood to do that. But it's only a little bit that needs to be cleaned up 100%. Um, yeah, got to be in the mood to do it. I've just been loving my, my garden and trying to, oh, harvesting the um, the blueberries later on. So, um, most likely, I will put it on TikTok or Instagram, excuse me, or here. So, be sure to follow me, Go10Lisa, 
And I still haven't put the podcast episodes on YouTube. It's out there as far as the pod, uh, as far as um, where you listen to for podcasts. They're out there. The episodes for season 25. But other than that, I'm not doing much. I did a lot this morning. So I like to do stuff early in the morning. And therefore, in the afternoon, I get to chillax a little bit. But we'll see. And I have my body started tomorrow. And so it's like um, getting myself prep for the week, kind of. Mm -hmm. <coughs> <coughs> Went on the wrong, wrong pipe. Well, cheers to you, my fam bam, my Goats and Lisa fam bam, my subscribers, my not subscribers. Thank you all for watching. I only have a little bit left to go. But, yeah, I got to get my nails done, like I said. And, yeah. Oh. Oh. I hate wasting gas and going back and forth, but today I have been doing that. Oh. I was right there, and I could have just went into the store to get nail polish remover. Oh, my goodness. I didn't get nail polish remover. Let's see. Only have a little bit left. I think this should be enough to get uh, it removed. But they, they're not making them like they used to. There's one that I have upstairs. I don't even know what it's doing. I think I'm just going to throw it out. And the whole thing is full, but it's not erasing anything as far as the um, the nail polish. But yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, hmm. I was going to have an event um, tomorrow, but I was just like, I can't. I can't fit that in right now to do it. But other than that, um, I love taking naps where I can, if possible. But I feel like once I um, once I see what's on the telly, which is nothing, um, then I'm just gonna take a nap. And then if I'm able to, if I don't go back outside, if I don't do something else, if I'm not doing something else. And um, I think I'm all set. I was trying to think if I had something to do for the business always, but um, um, <clears throat> I think that's good for now. I'm just trying to think like what's upcoming but yeah, it all depends on how I feel, but I'm really in the mood to play like tennis or something. But um, but if not, that's fine. The pool is open. You know, I should go down and take a swim, but um, we'll see. <laughs> yeah. The pool is open <laughs> and working. <laughs> so yeah. I'm trying to decide if I should go to the one near me or the main clubhouse because I have two clubhouse and two pools. But I did see someone at the smaller one. I say all of this because sometimes the gate is not working, even though we all have a key. But um, it was broken last year. I hope they fixed it. And the main one... I think all the kids are in that one. So it's all about the timing of when you go. Because um, it's cute it's cute and everything. But it's like, sometimes I like to be in the water by myself. If you know, then go. Um, but yeah, yeah. I shouldn't get up early one morning. and Oh, but they open it late. Oh, they used to have it where you get to go. Well, actually, I have a key. So um, unless they're going to close it. 
unless the key is not going to work until a certain time. With this HOA, I'm just so over them and what they're doing. Just so over it. <sighs> and then they're sending <laughs> texts and community texts about events that they're having. And I was like, okay. And um, so, yeah. So all I want is just have the clubhouses open early. Suppose I want an early morning swim, you know? But I think it's one o'clock. I don't know why so late when the time is so hot. But I think the times that I went, um, but we'll see. But anyway, one day you'll see me um, post something about that or what have you. But yeah, that's what's happening. I just want to have lunch with you guys. Just have lunch. And catch up. So now... I'm just gonna pack away the food and um, change out of my outfit and um, and see, and just enjoy the rest of the afternoon. So it's nice having lunch with you guys. Until next time, go, 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 and enjoy your Friday afternoon. Peace, love, bye. Hey, mm -hmm. Mm I've been collecting my blueberries. I've been eating some of them. Oh my gosh, they're so sweet. Ow, I just hit my head again on the lighting. <laughs> I don't know what's up with me hitting my head. Bye guys. Wait a second, I just saw something. Yep, I gotta clean up for there. <laughs> Later. <laughs> okay, it won't shut off. Oh my God.